we are on a highway trip right now and I've been using autopilot for several hours this morning. It is, what is it? April 21st, 2017. And we've had a couple of problems with the autopilot. Two of them where the autopilot slammed on the brakes. And I think Denise was saying it actually happened as we were going underneath a bridge, but it just slammed on the brakes twice and there was nothing in front of us to where it needed to slam on the brakes. And they had shadows too, right? Yeah, your car got spooked by the shadow of the bridge. That's what it was? <laughs> yes. Okay, the other thing we've had a problem with, I'll try to demonstrate it here, is where a lane merges onto the freeway and it opens up and doesn't use a acceleration lane that has dotted lines. And it just, this car moves over and fills the whole lane, which kind of freaks out other drivers nearby. And it makes them think that they can, well here, this one has dotted lines, see that? That's preventing it from happening here. But here, now it's gonna open up, see what happens. Look at the display, see how the display, look at that. It goes wide open, now it's moving over. We're moving over to the right. It didn't happen that, it wasn't that dramatic there, but in some of the instances, it's been really dramatic. Like when we came off of I-95 on the I-85, and actually we got a, a, a warning buzzer and red display saying that basically the car had lost control or something. And, and all. And it almost, caused you to drop your bagel. It did? Oh, okay, yeah, that would have been a disaster. <laughs> but we could have run into somebody, who knows what could have happened. There was thankfully nobody right next to us when that happened, but that was pretty bad. So we've noticed these problems today and we're using the latest version, 2018.10.4, but these are still major, major safety issues that need to be addressed. And I'm just making this video so that you're aware of it if you're using this, that these things are happening and happening on a regular basis. Is, both of them have happened multiple times on this trip today while we were driving. Okay, I almost forgot to mention on this video one other thing that's happened, and Denise witnessed this, so I'm not making it up. I had the signal down, I was doing the auto lane change, and I had it all the way down, and all of a sudden the vehicle just jerked all the way back, all the way back into the right lane, like out of nowhere and really hard at a high speed. So that is something that has not been perfected either. I've made videos about that too. But again, these are three, those three things I just mentioned, three serious safety issues that need to be addressed in this version of autopilot. Because until they're addressed, I mean, I gotta be on the lookout. Any driver needs to be on the lookout really for these situations to make sure that if they happen, which could happen at any time, that you're able to take control.